While a victory in the courtroom for a Detroit police corporal facing charges for punching a naked woman in the hospital. You may remember this video. It landed him on the other side of the law. It all unfolded at Detroit Receiving Hospital, and today the judge dropped the felony charge against that corporal. 7 Action News reporter Kim Russell is in the newsroom now to show you why the judge says she made that decision. Kim. When you take a look at this case, it really paints a picture of just how hard it is to be a police officer and also how hard it is to be mentally ill. During the preliminary exam for 47-year-old Detroit Police Corporal Dwayne Jones, the judge watched police video that shows him respond to help a woman who was completely naked outside in Detroit last August. He and another officer take the woman to Detroit Receiving Hospital for help. Corporal Jones and Officer Taylor exhibited nothing but kindness to her. But once at the hospital, it appears the woman starts to hallucinate and to become aggressive, spitting at and biting officers. Prosecutors say this video shows Corporal Jones responded with excessive force. Oh my God, is this what we expect, we expect of our officers? Is this how they are to be handling the people, those who are most in need of help? I really don't know what the Wayne County Prosecutor's Office want the, the Detroit police officers to do nowadays. He is trying everything to get her under control. I don't believe you assaulted anyone. You acted appropriately. You just heard the judge say she doesn't believe he assaulted anybody. Still, she did rule that there is enough evidence for the misdemeanor assault and battery charge to go to trial. However, the felony misconduct in office charge is dropped. She says there's not enough evidence to go to trial on that. In the newsroom, Kim Russell, 7 Action News. Such a tough case. All right, Kim, thank you.